Welcome back to the boys' club. Yeah, we got a spicy one now. Oh, you can turn up a little bit. Yeah, we got a Show your child the drums. Yo, yo, let's get a little bit on that tub. The niggas on that tub. Oh, yeah. Uh, that's what I need to do. I need to move there. Move the groove. Move the groove. That's what we're doing now. I'm going to name the game. In fact, when they step out the game, it's never going to be the same. All these boys are so the list of this way, yeah. We got like a player, so we got dirty number child, the drums on the pillars on the funky girl. Cylindrical covered skin boxes of the room. And I'm such a lucky guy. Not only do I surround myself with the sexiest sex, the world has ever seen all the damn time. I got a incredible musician on the other side of me right now. I got Jesse the awesome lot. What the fuck? Stat. We need water. We're we're making hits. We're making hits here. We need parts. Right, right there. Jesse's professional. He's wow. he's he's producing tonight. Uh oh ah oh, dang I'm too late on that one. I was. Can I have a little sip of yours? Absolutely, Absolutely dude. Cool. Cool. You can have half of it because that's how it should be. Bam 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 bam. <laughs> Katie likes it. Yes yes. <laughs> She's on uh, that 50 50 indica sativa. Uh, uh. <laughs> good life. Skeptic or believer. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Uh, I think as we, the more footage, the more that we, we uh, the more that we do together, the happier we'll be. Uh, we might get into certain, certain grooves. I want to talk about whatever happened to that song um, right now. Whatever happened to that song, uh, living my best life. Living like, my best living life. Living my best life. I ain't gonna go to uh, <clears throat> It's like rated R. Yeah. Uh, but I thought it was dope. Um, I forget. Dang it. I At the moment, I forget who it is. Snoop Dogg has a, a, a drop in it. Um, it came out like two years ago. And it's great. It's just uh, like all about li- like living my best life. And that's... I can... Anyone can honestly say that, and you're like, "Yo, like how you how you living? Like, I'm living my best life. I love that because I always I, I kind of always feel I'm like I'm I'm, I'm, falling, I'm falling to pieces. Yeah, yeah. Whereas like sure. it's good. I'm just lucky to be in the presence. I, well, I entropy's hard on me. Mm-hmm. And some people was like, "Yeah, fuck, yeah, right, yeah, but whatever, whatever. Yeah, I'm good too. That's true. But then. I- <laughs> On the flip, I feel like then sometimes, just sometimes, you hear some stories of them later on, like the people that were the coolest cucumbers <laughs> actually were like freaking out at times. 
Which then it makes you feel a little better where you're yeah. like, yeah, 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 that's part of it. It's all it's to like yeah, think yeah. you're falling apart, but actually mm-hmm. you are throwing some good stuff out there. Yeah, it's all, yeah, it's all, yeah, it's a flow. <laughs> yeah, it's, a, it's a stream, not a highway. Yeah. Mm. You know, all right. Uh, we were talking lightning round. <laughs> uh, <coughs> lightning round <coughs> questions. <laughs> First. <laughs> The lightning round question begin. Bolton. Bolton. Oh, okay. Not uh, Michael. Bolton. Like Usain Bolt. Uh, <laughs> what if, if there's going to be a track race, what are you running? Mm-hmm. Uh, a car track race? Uh, no, like if, we're, like if it's a track and field meet, <laughs> what event are we doing? What are you, oh. like, what's your, like, what would your oh. event? Uh, I don't know all the, uh, the official ones, but I'm like a... I say a nice medium race. Um, <laughs> are you like like medium like medium distance wise? Yeah, yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. and height, <laughs> height, um, weight, everything medium. Yeah, weight. Because yeah. <laughs> you can also like pole vault, you can javelin. <laughs> I, yeah, you could. I mean, like you shot, you got strong, you you got push. Um, yeah, let's do a weight. I guess I don't. Yeah, I haven't been to many. Like a hundred meter. That sounds about right. Okay. Is that like a football field length? That's about a football field length. Yeah, right? that's a good one. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. All right, Josh, what's your uh, having a track meet? Uh, 200 meter. 200 meter. <laughs> Bam. Half a lap, just zit. <laughs> <laughs> I, I take a while. That the Yeah, I take a while to get up to speed. But once I get up to speed, I have, like, good top-end acceleration. So mm. 200 has always been a, a better better setup. But the 400 feels like you're going to die. 400 is the hardest thing to do in the whole wide world. <laughs> 400 <laughs> meters is like... Apparently my mom did the 400, and she was just telling me about some times that, you know, she just was, yeah, just feeling like she was going to go down. Oh. <laughs> I loved the mile. Uh, but I'd like... Actually, no, my favorite was the half mile. Uh, but... Just the fact that I could finish like a two mile and like mm-hmm. score points, whatever. When I did run track in high school, I would do like the two mile. I would r- just run so much. And sometimes I hated it. You would always, you know, obviously you'd <laughs> like, run the mile like, for, oh my God. Dude, run the mile for amazing. school. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. I wanted like to break four minutes in the mile. I was, cl- I was like, oh, what? Working on it. Dang. Yeah, I got like force. There's Dude. one kid in my class who would always just like stop and sniff the dandelions and our. Teacher would be like, "Go, tortoise, in, tortoise in the hair, man. Yeah. <laughs> tortoise in hanging hair. out. Yep, yep. Uh, I like it. pole vault's crazy. Pole vault's nuts. Yeah, I wish so, I wish I could. That is them. crazy. Nuts when the when you get to the point of a pole vault, a pole vaulter, when you fully when you fully send yourself <laughs> invert it. <laughs> off the the force of this spring, just boy. That so happens oh. to be a, like a javelin, and the and the pole is <laughs> eighteen feet in the air, <laughs> and you're you know you're six feet tall, or whatever, and you stick it, well, boing, and like when they fully yeah when they're they're fully out, I just think that is oh so much faith that that I just those like things break that dude. thing breaks Thanks. that bad scenario, and that's why we watch. Yeah, There's some crazy, yeah, like ski jumping. Here, that's a hero right there. Sick. Yeah, that's what do you say about sk- what ski <coughs> jumping? Oh my goodness, is that that's the, like that's the, just the big the old ski jumping? It's just pretty much just flying yeah. on skis. <coughs> yeah, yeah, dude. Just <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I know. Very unforgiving. <laughs> uh, you've got yeah, you've got a, uh, some sort of ski jumpers. I've I've met a ski jumper, the Olympic caliber. Mm. It's a lifestyle. There, absolutely. Send it. Absolutely. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Yeah. Big time sending. Oh, yeah. yeah. Summer send. Um, all right. Lightning round. Uh, speaking of send it, one time I was like, yo, send it. Uh, I was house sitting. I was dog sitting for this uh, fam that had a, uh, like, Tour de France level bike, carbon fiber. Mm. Uh, and they're on the, they already lived on a hill. And it would, I just got on the bike, just like, just feel what it's like. And it was like, holy smokes, this is amazing. I'm going uh, totally up the hill, but it, like, it feels effortless. This is it's, like sick. And I didn't have shoes on because uh, it was, I just like slipped onto it. And then next thing you know, I'm at the top of this, uh, it's like super 
super, uh, almost like dead man's drop kind of scenario. Uh, and on the top of it, and I've got this incredible racing machine, and I just have my, my cell phone for a light, and it's got, like, just, you know, super thin tires. So, like, like I might, uh, I might fly off this machine and just, you know, uh, go into the night, but, like, it must be done. Uh, it was in the name, you know, st- you know, just send it. You got to send it. So I, so I send it with my you know, cell phone light, got in the way, make it down to Dead Man's Drop, uh, and then I get to the point of, like, uh, the, the hill coming into the, the straightness of the valley, something caught my gaze to the, to the right. Or no, I was looking down at the ground to make sure there's no the cracks. I would just uh, make this, this wheel fall in. And I look up, and there's a deer with antlers in my face. Uh, and I'm cruising at, like, I don't know, 35 to 40 miles an hour. And I just turn my head as it was just moving its head up uh, and our eyes met and I stayed <laughs> on my bike and I was still going like 30 miles an hour and like the road was straight and it was, I was safe and I just like <laughs> let out this gasp of just like, yes. <laughs> That was the close, like my head almost like exploded on this, <laughs> on this deer. Like I just like, and like, oh, so what is, and like if I died that way, it would have been totally fine. On Like I would have been all right with that. If like on my gravestone. It was, it was one deer. He sent it and he, was it a buck? He liquefied his face on a, a buck's mm. head. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. Or so, yeah, or just whatever.